फाइव सेकेंड टू सेकेंड रेडी सर टुडे इन आवर कंट्री द बिगेस्ट प्रॉब्लम विच रिक्वायर सोल्यूशन एट द टॉप लेवल एंड इन द मोस्ट अर्जेंट मैनर इज द प्रॉब्लम ऑफ पॉपुलेशन एक्सप्लोजन वी आर आल अवेयर दैट वी आर एडिंग वन ऑस्ट्रेलिया टू इंडिया एवरी ईयर सो फार एज इनक्रीज इन आवर पॉपुलेशन इज कंसर्न इन स्पाइट ऑफ आवर ट्रेमंडस एग्रीकल्चरल आउटपुट I do not think by 2000 AD we will be able to match the growth in our agricultural production with the exploding growth of population and so far as the availability of houses schools and other amenities which are required for our population is concerned we will be lagging behind far far behind even today most of our economy and most of our budget are allotment caters for building up infrastructure facilities only this has resulted in stagnation of development of our country i would suggest to the honorable minister some of the points which may go a long way to make our country or our society more aware of the necessity of controlling the population and making the family planning program of the government a success my first suggestion is that society of involvement should be more intensified today most of the family welfare and family planning programs are being made executed and monitored by the government my suggestion is that more and more non government social organizations should be involved the biggest hurdle in our country today is religion somehow we are still suffering a phobia of having a son and in the search for a son people produce a string of girls not that the girls are not welcome but this is the philosophy of some of the religions there are some religions where use of family planning devices is being condemned there are some religions where abortions are supposed to be anti religious so far age our villages are concerned the family planning movement definitely desires to be intensified today the rural areas are more urban oriented we are having more family planning movements in the urban areas where the rich the upper middle and the middle class live we all know that in this class of society people have taken family planning seriously and successfully so far as the family planning movement is concerned but in villages we still require the necessity of having this movement intensified the basic reason is that so far as poor people are concerned the poor people living in the 
urban areas they think that having a large number of children is an economic boon if a laborer has five small children aged 10 or 12 years they can start working as domestic help in the houses of rich upper middle and middle class people by doing so they bring some money and the house where they go and work there they get free food the second hand clothes and so on so economically for a poor family that much number of children is not a burden because they neither get education nor they have any standard to look for so there should be some movement started by the family welfare development itself in collaboration with other ministries under which the children of poor should be looked after and they should be given employment the honorable prime minister has stated that one person from each family will be given employment under the scheme which has been incorporated as per this year's declaration this program must be intensified with a view to giving them more respectful and proper employment so far as education is concerned i think the education ministry is not doing their bit as much as they can do it has been found that even in some states of our country where the literacy percentage is very high like kerala the population has been much better controlled the result of family planning movement has been much better in those states in our country where education has been intensified at the primary and middle levels particularly the education of women so far as our rural areas are concerned the stress on education is not as much as it should be so far as women are concerned it is because women can play a much more predominant part in controlling the population rather than men in the end i will suggest that as the environment is becoming better for making the family planning program a success we should also give the family planning program the seriousness it deserves in our budget but i am sorry to say that in the entire budget document there is not even a single line about family planning program when we are spending so much of money to look after the poor the unemployed their housing problem their education their medical care their all sorts of requirements cannot be spent some money to ensure that the population of the poor people who have become a liability of the government should be contained cannot we give them some sources of entertainment there is hardly any place for their entertainment there is hardly any playground 
फॉर दियर चिल्ड्रेन देयर इज हार्डली एनी क्लब फॉर दियर इंटरटेनमेंट ऑल द प्लेसेस ऑफ इंटरटेनमेंट आर पेट्रोनाइज बाई रिच पीपल